The U.S. Special Representative for Afghanistan, Zalmay Khalilzad, arrived in Islamabad on Monday, hoping to convince the Pakistani leadership to play a constructive role in the ongoing Afghan peace talks. Khalilzad met both the civilian and the military leadership in Pakistan and pressed upon the establishment to not play spoiler. The deep state in Pakistan is involved in sponsoring and orchestrating terror attacks across the border. There is now fear that this trend will derail the reconciliation process in Afghanistan. The U.S. Special Envoy will also visit India today, where he is scheduled to meet India's External Affairs Minister S.J. Shankar. The two men will discuss India's role in the ongoing Afghan peace talks in Doha. Now remember, India is a major stakeholder in the region and was also invited to the opening ceremony of these talks. The visit comes just two days after the intra-Afghan talks opened in Qatar. The talks were off to a rocky start as clashes broke out between the Taliban and the Afghan forces. Merely hours after the opening ceremony, United that too. The government accused the Taliban of attacking its convoy along a highway in Kunduz. In response, the Afghan security forces carried out airstrikes in the provinces of Baglan and Jauzjan. Now, the government says that Taliban attacks have increased rather than decreased since the talks were announced. Representatives from countries including India, the United States, Turkey and Pakistan were also present at this opening ceremony. India's presence at the talks has not gone down too well with Pakistan. Securing a ceasefire will be the civilian side's biggest goal. But Taliban is yet to agree on it. Chief negotiator Abdullah Abdullah has hinted that the government could release more Taliban fighters in exchange for a ceasefire.